we can use our TI-84 calculator to enter data, produce scatter plots of our data, look at that data and decide if regression would be appropriate and what type of regression, and then we can perform regression on our data using the calculator. So the first step would be to enter our data into the calculator. We want to press STAT and then edit to enter calculator data. I already have our data in the calculator. I have X values in L1, where they go, and Y values in L2. If I did not already have the calculator in the data, I could simply clear the data out of L1 and out of L2 and then enter these data values. Once these data values are entered, we want to create our scatter plot. We do that by doing second and then stat plot, which is at the Y equals key. And then our stat plots are already on for plot one. We'll go ahead and look at plot one by pressing enter. If stat plots were off, then it would look like this, and we could simply scroll over to on and select enter to turn the stat plots on. Also, we want to make sure our type is the scatter plot type. So we scroll down until we see type. And the very first type is the scatter plot with the little dots. So we press Enter to select that type. And then it says our X list is L1 and our Y list is L2, which is how we have entered our data. X is L1, Y is L2. So those are both OK. And then we just want to graph the data. It's best if we go ahead and press Zoom 9, because Zoom 9 will zoom right in on our statistical data. So anytime you're doing scatter plot data or any stat plot data, I recommend pressing Zoom 9 to see the graph, Zoom, and then 9 for statistics. And there are scatter plot points. So they look roughly linear, so let's do some regression. To do regression, we'll go to Stat and then Calculate. We have linear regression, quadratic regression, cubic regression, quartic regression, and there are even some other regression types. We knew that we wanted linear regression, and so we will select the first linear regression option and press Enter. Linear regression takes L1 as the X values and L2 as the Y values by default, and since that is what we have, we'll just press Enter here. This gives us y equals 1.4x plus 4.2. And so we will go to our y equals and enter that data. 1.4x plus 4.2. And then we'll graph. Now we see both our scatter plot points and our linear regression equation, and we can see how well our linear regression equation fits the data.